Hello people, it is I again and Troyus. You alright? Now today is the day of many bays. We're going to go, we're actually going to go on a walk, but hopefully to walk to Broadstairs. And um, well, we'll see how that pans out. About 10 miles? Walk. Yeah. Yeah, it's about a 10 mile walk. <laughs> so we'll see how that goes, but we want to show you some of Margate beforehand and see if you like what you see. Um, you know, <laughs> your hair looks awesome. That's that's the hair did look awesome. Cheese and pickle sandwiches make my mum are heavy in my lap. Okay, that makes sense, doesn't it? Do you like cheese and pickle sandwiches? Uh, I do, favourite. Really? Yeah, we're going to come up to Dreamland in a minute, which is just behind those these horrible buildings over here. And there's lots of arcades as well. Yeah, literally, this was the place to be when we were younger. Margate was like, you know, you had to come here. There was arcades, there was everything. And now it's just a dive, a really bad dive, where they send you where you don't... This is where, if you become homeless, they send you here. Troy's taking pictures of high-rises. Is this your future home, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> the beach is there. We'll go over to the beach in a minute. But we'll just show you the entrance to Dreamland. This is the entrance to Dreamland. And it's it's quite... Yeah. And at the entrance, um, before they changed it all, there used to be a, a ride in the in the start of it and it used to be like a like it used to be called Tunnel of Love Tunnel of Love yeah and it used to like, like a little rapid ride and, and it used to take you around oh okay well I took you around where? inside there but but that, but that was the ride at the start he used to, used to go on that when I was a kid you can tell now he still wants to go on it <laughs> he wants those memories yeah, back it was, it was good. yeah I, I have fond memories of Dreamland I'm not going to complain about it but I just, you know, I'm just again, like I say, looking at it from adult eyes, thinking, really, wasn't there like a really dangerous um, roller coaster in there, like a wooden one from still, like the war or something? Yeah, still there now. To, they're not allowed. They're not allowed to knock it down because it's history, it's like heritage. Oh yeah, we have this thing, the heritage. They can't get rid of such things. It's got it's been burnt down twice, and they've, they've, they've had to sort it out. Like, well, they've rebuilt it. Not rebuilt it, but like. I've done all the damage parts to it. Okay. Of course, these are the arcades where another reason why you'd come to Margate, which. Oh, they're empty. There are no arcades in there. There are none at all. Really? Yeah. Like, what the hell has happened? This is why you would come to seaside places with the ice cream as well. Literally no, no, no arcade. There's nothing in there, it's empty. Oh, bowling. Yeah, it's empty. That's crazy. Okay. Life is a beach. <laughs> okay. show you the beach in Margate another reason why people came here there was a episode of Rick Stein actually years ago where he had some seafood in Margate there's something like cockles um fish stall thing that she had again like I say Margate used to be the place to be but this my friends is Margate Beach Down, hit, down there, yeah. The like jungle there used to be a sweet shop, and it, and like the, the big tubs where they weigh in on the scale. Yeah. And like, used to go, like, go in there all the time when I was a kid as well. Do you think the sweet shop's still there? Oh, I've got a clue. So we're going to see if it's still there. Can do. We're going to go and see if there's a sweet shop. Yeah. 
you go, look. Got all the... All the way you weigh in and stuff. No, that's all gone. Oh. Ask him if it used to be the sweet shop. Troy, ask if there is a sweet shop where they do the where they do you. What do you say? Sweet shop's still about, but it's where the Sandy Hotel is. Which is where? Well, he was serving. Over there, that monstrosity of a building is an art gallery. This building just there. It's a, it's, I don't know the name of it. I'll forget the link of the name and I'll put it in like the bottom of the video. But it's a horrible building. It actually looks worse now than it did when it first opened. It's dirty, never been cleaned. I'll show you this a second. It's pretty cross the road. Or not cross the road. Oh, it's letting us cross the road. I'll show you over here. This is the beach here again. Quite a nice view actually. Okay, we're taking a detour because I've just discovered something that Troy will like. Troy's looking at it confused. Yeah, but you know about the, the street shop? It is a sweet shop, yeah. Are you sure it's the same one? No, it's probably not the same one, but it's they do in the where they count it out, they measure it and stuff. Yeah. So let's see. Do you, know, do, you, do you know what I used to get from here? What did you used to get from here? Well, not here, but when the, the other one, the what? Dweebs and Nerds. It's like candy. You know the Nerds yeah, candy? Yeah, yeah, the American but one. But it's the Dweebs as well, which is... The, yeah, the Dweebs, yeah. The candy, yeah. But they stopped making the Dweebs. I used to think they were called Fizzy Jerks and Nerds. No, Nerds and Dweebs. Ner nerds and Dweebs. They're just insults, really. <laughs> but this is a sweet shop, and again, another seaside thing. I, I didn't know about the... Um, Got all the ones up there. Yes, he's, he's all excited now, but yeah, he doesn't want to buy anything. It's open, and he's pretending it's not. <laughs> he's like a kid in a candy store. <laughs> yeah, when you come to. Oh, he is. Okay, he's going in. What is? Oh, your thingy. I can't yeah, see him. Because I remember, I remember when I was a kid, I used to get the shadow, but I couldn't do that now, and I got bad teeth. I remember, I remember they used to, like dreams and nerves used to come in in a in a in a, in a jar. The guy doesn't care to. I just buy something. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's very really important these days. So. so, like I was saying. One of the other things about the seaside, you don't get your ice cream. Well, you do get, you get your ice cream, you get your donuts, you get your fish and chips, but of course you get the sweet shops. That was one of the things that I used to do when I was a kid as well. My mum would take me to a sweet shop and you would get a quarter or something. Now, Troy, what have you got? Chocolate Brazil nuts. Say it again for the camera. <laughs> chocolate Brazil nuts. You got chocolate Brazil nuts, which are Brazil nuts covered in chocolate, quite simply. Um, so we found the sweet shop. It may not have been the one that he remembers no, as a kid. It's not the one, but it's I'm, I'm happy. He's happy. He's got his sweets. He's got his sugar fix. I haven't because he didn't take the hint. So hungry. Do you want to say that? No, I'm fine. That place there, the the seafood fresh daily, that was where Rick Stein recorded from his, um, well, I guess it was a seafood odyssey program that he recorded there. Um, the horrific art gallery, whatever, that I was discussing before, I will now tell you that it's called the Turner Contemporary.
If you're in Margate, then fair enough, go to it, but... If you're not, don't bother. <laughs> yeah, if you're not, just leave it. Do you want to go to the Turner Contemporary? Yes. Yes. No, I really don't. No, he doesn't. I choose Pepsi. As we venture, one thing is becoming very apparent. A lot of Margate appears abandoned. Now we're trying to figure out what this is. Now this is maybe some sort of nightclub or something like that. Like it does weddings and parties. So I'm guessing maybe, but at first like it's the Lido area. Now I don't actually know, but it's literally on on like the cliff, isn't it? Like above the water. We'll go over to the water area. It's decaying, it's decrepit, the buildings, there's graffiti everywhere. Oddly enough, standing here kind of gives me the impression of being in like a World War II bunker. Like a sniper, I don't know, being in a bunker, maybe that's what they were used in the old days, I don't know. But it's just, it's eerie how it's really eerie. And you can, we're looking out on the ocean and there's just nothing. Like whether it's Margate, whether it's anywhere, Broadstairs, or which is where we're hoping to end up. What other people doing pictures in there? Yeah, we've got people down there doing pictures. That's literally what this has come to, that just people doing silly little vlogs or pictures because there's nothing else here other than history which is very important now we need to go down onto this path down here so just go from there to there <laughs> yeah Troy it's a good idea we'll just jump down in 1978 Margate was struck with a fierce storm I would say and um, it literally destroyed the pier that was here and it also destroyed where I'm standing right now which was the old Lido, the swimming pool area. Now, a minute ago, we were just up there looking down and I had no idea what it was. And Troy looked at me and went, I think it's a swimming pool. And at first I was looking around, I was like, maybe it was. The thing that gave it away for Troy is that there's actually like a mosaic sort of thing. So this isn't a bald and bankrupt Soviet mosaic. This is just a, I don't know, a UK mosaic. And I'll show that to you now. We're currently walking where the water would have been. You can just imagine there, the families would have sat down and watched their kids playing along. Even my mother may have even... No? 1978? Yes, my mother may have been down here and she did say that she would come down to these places for her summer holidays and stuff with her family because she lived in London. And you can just imagine her family, and my nan, would sit there and all the other people watching their kids swim in what is now covered in sand and grass. And then you can have the swimming and look out to the ocean. Clearly, they never decided to get it fixed. Now, looking upon this, to me, it still looks like an army fort. I can just imagine sniping and, you know, you play the Medal of Duty, Medal of, Medal yeah, of Honor cool, games, yeah. Call of Duty. They're the same game, anyway. Children swimming and <laughs> parents watching and snipers being pointed at them. Thanks, Troy. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, he's valid point. Uh, what does it say? It says the Lido Sands. So here is your English mosaic. And as you can tell, it leads right out onto the ocean and you can see as far as, far as the eye can see. And back there, Margate. But yeah, so here you are, the Lido Swimming Pool, 1978, RIP. <laughs>